Guys, not Malema exposing EDA. DA received millions and millions in a company that uh, not long ago they were in and out of courts for a lot of money that, you know what I'm saying, went uh, under carpet. Musimai Mane receiving monies from that company. Don't worry, you think I'm speaking out of evidence? No, I'm going to insert the video as an evidence. The video is here. I'm seeing it as of now. I'm going to insert that video. Just pay attention to this 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 is one of one of the most important video here one of the things that is being said here is that um nobody's questioning them right nobody is questioning eda for the money that they benefited from staying off in fact i saw a post look because i was watching the media look at the the the, the, look, the press press briefing gamalema right so when it was scrolling or what, I, or was it on, on X? I saw that the money that they are talking about, it amounts to 30 million and above. Uh, Musi, my money received a, a, look, a car uh, together. I think it, they also received a house of some sort. But it shows that company has been giving them a lot of money. Yet, here's, here's, the, here's the thing. We haven't even reached the gist of the matter, right? Yet. Here's the gist of the matter. All these companies that does the so-called, what we call it, investigative journalism. I'm putting it in bracket, bracket commas because, uh, look, with inverted commas because it is like this investigative journalism, it only works towards the people that they are trying to destroy. But it's not necessarily some, a tool that is used to get the truth because if you think of the stain of thing and everything, you'll remember, let me, let me give you context. There's a guy called, there's a guy who's a boss of Farmer 28 or what in Cape Town who has been arrested, right? Uh, is connected also to stain off, right? Um, you've got people like that. So if you're looking at news, they were able to investigate and find the guy. They went to the VPS, but they leave stain off and DA. Here's the question that these people are asking. Why is it that no journalist is questioning the DA receiving money from Stainoff? But they are very quick to remind us about Palapala. In fact, I will even stand with Malema here because if it was Gansa, it, was all over, it would have been all over the news. Um, look, now it's Palapala, now it's VPS, it's all over the news. But what about Palapala? Look, sorry, it's VPS, VPS and EFF is all over the news. But what about Palapala? Remember, I kept asking you guys that there's something funny that we're not being fed. It's about Palapala. Nobody's saying anything. Stand up. And DA, nobody's saying anything. There's a video of Malema asking such a question. Well, 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 there's a question that I need to ask you. And it is this. If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people. Because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. To click the notification bell, it is free of charge. To share this video, it is free of charge. To watch this video until the end, it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean, come on, to watch the ads, it's free of charge. And that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financial contribution to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the super thanks party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? We'll bring you more. And also guys wanna buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed okay so having done what we're supposed to do ask the questions we were supposed to ask deal with everything that we're supposed to deal i know you're asking the evidence but i'm gonna waste the evidence now where my lemma was asking this question to say the DA is uh, look. The DA is getting away with a lot of things, and if the DA is getting a, a, away with a lot of things, isn't a proof enough that the EFF they are being attacked? Which again, it proves my point. When I said to you guys, um, it's funny how the media may want to make us focus on EFF, but there's, there's pala pala before EFF. Now that they, that it's, you know, this whole thing, guys, no, man. Something is fishy about this whole thing. 
They want to they want us to focus on EFF, deal with EFF, EFF corrupt, EFF this, EFF that, EFF this, but stay off DA. Nobody's talking about it. Wait, this is what EFF said. Malema here. Many billions disappeared. DA never get questioned. Musi my money received a car from Stainoff, that matter is still not spoken about. Musi Maimani received a house from Stainoff, that matter is not spoken about. The white corruption in this country is not spoken about. Your many billions disappeared, DA never get questioned. Musi Maimani received a car from Stainoff, that matter is still not spoken about. Musi Maimani received a house from Stainoff, that matter is not spoken about. The white corruption in this country is not spoken about. Yo. So guys in Peg, uh, there is no, like, you, you, this is what I wanted to notice. News 24, we know. When they write about EFF, they attack them. When they write about Zuma, they attack them. Um, Daily Maverick, we know. When they write about Zuma, they attack. When they write about MK, they attack. When they write about EFF, they attack. Shivam, Malem, they attack. And you must notice this. This is I'm going somewhere. You must notice that when well, in, in them writing, they consistently write things. They don't stop. So if there are what if if the, these newspapers are not politically motivated to fight other people, if they happens to talk about do their investigating look, do their investigative duties as investigative journalists, to stain off and DA linkage. Be careful. They should not look if they were if they are saying what I would do, but we have done that. You must be careful. This is what this is what you must check. You must check how many times do they have to report on that one. It could be that they just want to release the story once off and then get look, move away from the story and go back to the older story of EFF and VPS. Older story of the impeached judge. You know. Because that's how they thrive in. Uh, that's what I'm saying. I'm saying to say, guys, you must be careful of your media, man. You must be careful of your media. These people are supposed to be free, fair, and independent, but they are the exact opposite of the word free and fair. They are the exact opposite of independency. They have taken a political stand, and they are using their look, their power to destroy those who is regarded as um, a, look, an, an enemy to them. That is a problem that I'm, 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 I'm facing or I'm faced with here. Good to know, man. We've got a very, 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 very serious problem here. How do we deal with this problem at hand? Speaking about the problem at hand, another problem that we have is the fact that there are people who are not subscribed to the channel. That's another big problem that we have. Um, because, I mean, we, we need to take this channel to 60,000 subscribers. So, mm -mm. I'm having a very, very, very serious challenge there. But before we can even, you know what I'm saying, uh, talk about anything else, to continue to subscribe, guys. Now, you guys, please tell me something. What should we do as a solution to this problem? Don't you think that there is a conversation that is supposed to happen right now? A conversation where the issue of the issue of um, maybe each, like EFF has already been doing. They've got their own podcast. Uh, maybe it's not enough. Maybe now they need to have their own newspaper as well. On television state station. Same thing to MK Party. Have your own newspaper. Have your own podcast. And ultimately, and I'm surprised, Gay, speaking about MK Party, I'm surprised that they haven't done all of those things because MK Party is supposed to have a MK Party podcast official because there are channels that are doing the MK Party stories. I saw also a channel that was looked like it was an official channel from MK Party, but I was also not happy with how they are running things there in that channel. I just wish I was like, mm, I wish I was close so to advise and bring some certain things together, but I feel like it is now important for e Abo Amapaloka political parties to have their own things. We have seen e ANC introducing their own podcast right now. So they will interview their own comrades there and people that aligns with the ANC as well. So it's more like 
it is important not to depend on other people or depend on these newspapers now for 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 them to 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 give genuine news and authentic it is very important for people not to rely on those people so yeah i think it it raises such a conversation that needs to be had among people 